Hello everyone, this is going to be a short video on the chest roll, or front half Steve, and the propeller, two moves which at the moment I seem to favour, and end up going back to again and again. The front half Steve is a similar technique to the back half Steve, funnily enough, that I showed in my previous video. However this time, when you're holding it, you'll be holding it with the centre of the staff slightly off from the thumb end, rather than the little finger end of your hand. Also, as you let go, you'll be rolling the staff down the inside of your arm rather than the back. Again, you wait for the end of the staff to pass your head, and this should be your cue to let go. Try to vary the speed and the amount you lean back so that it rolls across your chest just below your neck. Too high and it'll be uncomfortable, too low and it'll roll downwards too much towards the end of the move. You'll still be able to complete the move, but it'll probably be messy. Uh, keep trying this on both sides until you feel comfortable. The propeller is a great recovery move for horizontal moves, just like the hand wrap, if you've seen my first tutorial, is a nice one for vertical moves. It's also great for performing to music, as you can set a rhythm to it. The propeller itself consists of wrapping the staff around one of your forearms continuously. As you move your arm forward, the staff moves up towards the elbow, as you move back, it moves towards the wrist. So by twisting your arm differently, you can adjust the staff's position on it to redress any weight imbalance. Excuse the location change on this shot, but I forgot to get this when I was out and about. Um, but this clearly shows the staff moving up and down the arm and roughly where it should be on the forward and backward motion. Now that you've got that, you can put them all together with the back half Steve and go from back to propeller to front or cut out the propeller and do a full and finally a continuous full Steve. Once again, like and subscribe if this has been any help and I'd love to see videos of you actually doing these moves. Also, what moves do you find yourself going back to again and again? Drop me a comment below.